Hello, crypto party people. I'm Fink, and this is my NFT show. Hello, everybody, and I hope you're ready for the sexiest episode yet. We are going to do a Harley Quinn showcase today. Uh, love Harley Quinn, love her in the cartoons, love her in the comics, love her in the live action. She's an amazing character in the DC comic world, and... She has a huge fan base, and through that, she's inspired a hell of a lot of art. I've found a few of those, and I'm going to put them up on the screen here for you today. First, I'm going to bring up Satoshi Girls number 41, of course, Harley Quinn theme. She has her bloody bat, she has her fishnet stockings, and of course, she has that underboob, y'all. Yeah, can't go wrong with some underboob. Very nice, very sexy little touch on this cute little animated version of the live action Harley Quinn, and you can find that in the Satoshi Girls collection on OpenSea. Next, I'm going to bring up from the Digimodels collection by Fat Panda on OpenSea. This one is simply titled Harley Quinn. And as you can see, it's the Margot Robbie. This is a painting of her live action character. And she has that iconic, just surprised look that she does oh so well. It's really perfect for the role. She's just an awesome Harley Quinn. And this is an awesome painting of her. And the colors, I know they're all going to be pink and blue, which I've just been drawn to anyhow. But I feel like it was an amazing use of it, the way they did this. And just a really cool painting. Said it took a whole lot of time to make it, and I'm sure it did. So check this out. It's in the Digimodels collection on OpenSea. Next, I'm going to bring up from NFT Satoshi Waifu. This is Waifu Quinn. And this is, as you can see, a pixelated version of the live action Harley Quinn and it is really neat has her bloody bat all pixelated out there and got the daddy's little monster saying above it which has became so synonymous with the Harley Quinn character and it's just another really cool Harley piece love it love the under boob nice touch always a great touch to add a little under boob even pixelated under boob so cool stuff Check that out. It is on the Satoshi Waifu collection on OpenSea. And of course, links for all of these will be in the description. Next, I'm going to bring up from Cryptina. This is Cryptina number 30. It is on OpenSea, and Cryptina is on Twitter. Love her. Love her stuff. She's awesome. All these Cryptinas are so very hot. There's a hundred of them something now. There's some that are up for grabs. You should definitely check out. This one is not. It is in Fink's wallet. And I, yeah, it's like the only one I've ever put up more than once as a PFP. Because I really love this NFT. So, yeah. Nonetheless, an amazing piece by an amazing artist. Check out Cryptinas on the open sea. Next, I'm going to bring up from Dungjuka is Onion by D50. This is Dungjuka number 65. And this is another one of my Harley Quinns. I love Harley Quinn. It's, I had to do this episode. Just love Harley Quinn. And as you can see, this is one of the Dungjuka monsters wearing the iconic, classic Harley Quinn jester outfit. A lot of people don't know this, but Harley actually got her start in Batman the Animated Series, and then hopped over to the comic world, which is just awesome. Very few characters ever do that. It's usually the other way around, but she's just an awesome character. And she grew to be the character we all know and love now. So, cool to see one done up in that iconic outfit that Harley Quinn wore whenever she first entered into the wonderful DC Universe. Now I'm going to bring one up that is not safe for work. This is Maria Quinn, and this is by Maria Freeman. This is a live-action cosplay version of the live-action Harley Quinn. Maria did these uh, beautiful, sexy pictures of herself cosplaying as Harley Quinn, and then had some effects added to it. Looks really cool, believe it or not. I know you didn't notice, but she has her iconic bat behind her, and... This is just gorgeous. You're young, you're beautiful, you're perky, and you're very brave for putting yourself out there like that. It's gorgeous, though. 
I love it. There's nothing more beautiful than the female form. There's nothing more beautiful than Harley Quinn. I think you fulfilled a lot of men and women's fantasies by letting me use this on the show. So thank you so much. And you can find that is the Maria Freeman collection on Nafty. That about wraps it up. Uh, we'll pop up real quick two that I made that actually got sold. One to Cryptina, the Harley Ethereum mashup, which is the Ethereum diamonds meshed into the Harley Quinn symbol, and that was a lot of fun to make. The other one is Splattered Quinn, uh, my two Harley Quinn themed NFTs. And also, I wanted to throw out there that I have a new drop. Just dropped it two nights ago. This is Blacklight Madness. As you can see, I did it on a tiny canvas. The details are tedious, but I think they're a lot of fun to make. I think they're a lot of fun to put under the black light, and I think they're a lot of fun to sell to nice collectors out there. So, love you all. Love this NFT community, and thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time on Fink's NFT Show.